Caitlin Raby, and today we are going to be doing a comic strip activity that I use to teach plot to a second grade classroom. Your materials for this lesson are white computer paper, coloring utensils like colored pencils or crayons or markers, my students use crayons, and a pencil to write sentences. Our first step is to get our paper and we're going to fold it into fourths. First we're going to fold it like a hot dog, just like this. You want to make sure to have good lines because the eight-year-olds need the lines. And then we're going to fold it again like a hamburger. And you're going to open it up. And you have four. Then I would recommend having your students draw the lines just so they keep the boxes straight. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. In second grade, they should have a fairly firm grasp on plot. So what they're going to do is, in my lesson, they read two different versions of the Three Little Pigs, and then they're going to create their own version like a comic strip. So we've already gone over the two versions. We've talked about famous comic strip artists, and our next step is to create our comic strip. So we've already folded our paper, and then just to keep the students straight, we're going to label our comic strip. So we're going to put title here, and it obviously won't be this big on their paper. In the beginning... middle, and end. Now not only is this a plot activity, but it can also be used for sequencing. So this is what theirs will look like once you've reached this phase. Your next step is they can title their own, depending on how you want to do it. I let my own students title theirs, and then they, they're going to draw a picture of the three major events in the story, and then they're going to write a sentence. Now this can be adapted for different students if you think that it's going to take them more time to figure out their beginning, middle, and end. Maybe you can remove the sentence part. Or if you feel like they're a little more advanced, maybe they can write more than one sentence. So, I have a finished product to show you. This is what I did quickly. So as you can see, we have a title, where the title is supposed to go, a story. So this is the beginning of The Three Little Pigs. It just says, The Three Little Pigs Leave Home, with a quick little picture. Then the wolf comes to town and blows down the houses, and then the wolf tries to blow down the brick house and the, wolf, the pigs outsmart him. This can be used over all sorts of curriculum-based things. I chose to use it in reading because the teacher that I was with wanted me to do plot, but just remember when doing this that you can adapt it any way you need it to. It can be adapted to go up or to go down based on your students' needs, and just let them use their own creativity. Thank you very much.